Welcome fellow travelers. Today we are at Red Mill Burgers, home of possibly Seattle's best burger. Red Mill Burgers remains one of Seattle's more popular burger destinations and won Seattle Weekly's Best of Seattle 10 years in a row. Up on the wall, the article from GQ which lists Red Mill Burgers as one of the 20 hamburgers you must eat before you die. We're going to try the Bacon Deluxe Burger which has a quarter pound beef patty, lettuce, tomato, American cheese and pepper bacon as well as a side of Babe's onion rings. Red Mill Burgers was spotlighted on an episode of Man Vs. Food. We're gonna give it a try. The Red Mill has its very own mill sauce, which is a smoky mayo, not a thousand islands. The sauce has a nice smoky flavor to it. and mixes well with the uh, melted American cheese and the pepper bacon is uh, amazing. Okay, I'm just gonna pull out a piece of the, uh, the bacon here. Check out this bacon. Give one of the onion rings a try. Thick onion rings, nice, crisp, battered, crunchy. It's a good onion ring. So bacon is indeed meat candy, and right here we have a lot of meat candy. This is the third iteration of the Red Mill Diner. Up on the wall, there's a menu from the first one, which existed until 1967. And hiding in the corner, there's a likeness of J.B. Patches. On a day like today, there's plenty of seating out front of the Red Mill Burgers, and right next door, a Starbucks coffee, because we're in Seattle. So that was a tasty burger, really enjoyed it. Uh, lots of smoky flavor, lots of cheese, lots of grease. Um, it was quite delicious. I can see why it was up there for running as one of Seattle's best burgers. If you're in the area, drop by, give it a try. Also very cool, right across from Red Mill Burgers, we can find one of the original Cold War air raid sirens. These were built around 1954 and continued to be tested until the 1970s. These air raid sirens were positioned around the city and in case of an attack would have called out for miles around the surrounding area to warn the local citizens. As usual, please subscribe to stay up to date with all of our latest adventures or check out the interactive map so you can see all the cool places that we've been. Until next time, it's time to exit through the gift shop.